All right, uh, I've had quite the day in trying to record a video. Um, I have most of the day been playing Paper Mario uh, on Switch. So in my head, I think that I'm still searching for toads and shit to rescue. Um, so I just tried to fire up Resident Evil 2 specifically, and I'm doing this so I don't waste this beautiful pun so that I could make video a video today titled Resident Evil Sa Day. It's brilliant. It's genius. Um, however, there's been a snafu with Resident Evil 2, and that is that snafu being that I... Oh, cutscene. This isn't important. Brad's radio in. No one gives a fuck about you, Brad. Brad. <sighs> anyway. Uh, I started the game and um, did maybe 20 minutes and uh, I got hit in the game. My energy or my health, not energy. Health was at danger. So I thought, hmm, I got red herbs, I don't have green herbs, I'll just keep going. Thinking I would find a green herb. I didn't find a green herb. I got to a boss and died. Uh, but just before the boss, I had saved it. Thinking, oh, I should probably save it here. Um, so if I do die, I don't have to go far. What I forgot about that is not to save over the file that had uh, all of the progress from the last 20 minutes. So I died, restarted a video, got rid of the commentary, uh, and then realized that for the second time in that walkthrough I had fucked up. Jesus, those snakes came from nowhere by uh, doing a bunch of the game and then auto-saving or saving uh, and yeah basically I don't think <laughs> I'm not sure I'm going to be able to beat that game because I don't have the magnum uh, there's there's a health that you can pick up at the boss um, however I think that I'm not good enough to beat the boss. It is basically what I'm getting at. If playing this game has taught me anything, or playing that game, I should say, it's that I am a bad gamer. I'm kind of like you'd imagine Woody was, um, without the the weird stuff. I'm not gonna say the weird stuff. I'm just throwing random. Uh, unsubstantiated rumors out there, as is my want. Uh, so, oh wait, no, I keep this for now, I think. Uh, because we're about to be introduced to one of, I think, everyone's favorite uh, enemies from a Resident Evil game. The Hunters. These big old frog looking fucks. I think they're, uh, I read that they are a cross DNA wise between humans and lizards. So, uh, yeah, as you can see, I don't really see the human part, to be honest with you. But what do I know? I thought that's what I had the key to. The Spencer thing? No? Mm. Let's take a look at the map here. What doors? Okay, I don't have access to that door. Or on the second floor, I would go up there. So I can get there. There, there. Sounds like I'm trying to 
uh, make someone feel better. There, there. It's all good. So, uh, my point for this all being that A, I fucked up big time. I am so sorry that you are all. Um, I mean, I genuinely don't know if I'm going to to complete the series because it was it's that much of a fuck up. There's a hunter around this corner. Nope. All right. It's a really big error, and I feel terrible for it. Uh, is this the? Is this the old boss that I think it is? No, it's not. Okay, perfect. <sighs> so, how's everyone been? Um, I've been, besides this, uh, feeling very weird the past couple weeks. That, that being without power for four days, although it's genuinely not a huge issue, it really threw off um, my brain, really. I know that sounds very strange to say, but um, I feel very weird after something like that. Like, I get, so I got used to, for example, I got used to having to charge my phone and shit multiple times a day at someone else's house. And, uh, I spent the next few days after getting power back being on my phone and saying, man, I should, I should not be on my phone. I'm gonna, gonna run out of battery. Which is stupid, because I could have obviously charged it at any time, but, but that's what happened. Hope I have enough uh, inventory spots here. Take the metal. Yes, there is a special way to use it. Jilly. This is also another uh, diary entry that I like a lot. Um... It gives you a lot of insight into uh, George Trevor, who is the, I believe, the man that Umbrella hired to um, to create this mansion, to to build it. And Lisa Trevor is the hot, sexy piece of ass that you saw in a previous episode that has sewn a bunch of faces on to her own. Shit, do I? I think I need to find an item box, to be honest. Oh, oh, fuck you. Son of a bitch. Poison me. At least I took one of his legs off. Okay, I do need, well, I guess I can, uh, I can heal here. Although that doesn't really do shit. So let's take out some spiders. Gross AF. Oh, I know where we are now. I know where we are. No, I don't. Thought I did. I don't. Get his shit pushed in, or his head blown up, really. That guy is fucking Rambo. He just went through all those bullets. What a monster. Uh, okay, combine that with that. I feel I need to pick up that blue herb, to be honest. To get rid of this poison effect. I also don't think that I should. 
Oh, okay. Sweet. I knew there was something I had to do here. As you can probably tell, I took no notes for this video. I started the Resident Evil 2 one thinking, yeah, I don't need notes. Genuinely don't know why that I convince myself um, that notes are for dummies. Because I'm a dummy. As, as proven by uh, the saving fuck-ups. I think there was a video the other day that I thought about doing like a... Oh, hey. Hey, boy. Hmm, is that it? That can't be it. Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay. Well, you know, I need to... I need to drop shit off. That's what I need to do here. Wait, I don't have the sword? Yeesh. Really went the wrong way here. I should have found somewhere with a bunch of, uh, with an iron box. And I didn't do that. Yeah, I was going to write a script for my Sonic 2. Because the first Sonic 2... Oh, I think that I told you in the video that I did a Sonic 2. And I was just... Uh, I wouldn't say I was in a bad mood. Oh, shit. That guy just fucking jumped out. Yeah, I wouldn't say I was in a bad mood. Look at that moth. It looks like it's on a green screen. Um, I was just in a, uh, in a funky mood. It's maybe how to put it. I gotta get rid of that other first aid spray and just get rid of this poison. And then I can combine those red and green. And then I'll be fine again. I'll be back to having a, basically a first aid spray. So yeah, when I when I did that Sonic 2 video again, I realized that I should probably um, write something out. Because it's at one point in that video I had got into be just being like, yeah, Sonic 2 is a classic, what do you think about it? And I realized that as much as I genuinely do uh, regularly ask for your opinions on shit, because I am interested in... A, the people that still watch these videos. Steve-O is usually pretty good at giving me feedback. Um, oh shit, I gotta combine those. That's right, that's right. Really should. I gotta come back here. I don't wanna lose out on that mag ammo. And I think these are acid rounds. Yeah, sweet. Do I just get rid of these fucking herbs? No. No, I don't. I've decided. I don't do it. I'm also trying to decide what to play. Uh, well, I say next, but... I should probably finish... At least this series before. <laughs> Maybe Resident Evil 2 if I can beat uh, Birkin. But that is probably going to be tougher than I anticipate. Uh, and I anticipate it being really tough. Alright. Have we got any Crimsons around here? I know there are some Hunters down the bottom here. Also, it's August the 22nd. How the fuck do I not know anything about the PlayStation 5? Uh, in terms of, like, price and release date and pre-orders. I... 
this is a really weird thing of Sony and Microsoft this year, it feels like. With them um, kind of holding out until the other uh, the other company gives up all their details. Because I think that Sony will probably... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Yeah, sell out of all their pre-orders. Don't know why that was such a tough word for me to think of, but it was. Uh, and I think that... Microsoft probably will too. Even if it's just Sony people that want a PS5 and can't, so they're getting the Xbox. I really want to know what happened. Oh. I want to know about the Xbox, because Microsoft seem to really still be taking this uh, opinion that they don't need uh, to have really great exclusives besides, obviously, Halo. Forza is a really... I, I don't want to make anyone that works on Forza, if any of them would ever watch this video, feel bad, but it is not a good game. Yeah, because I was too slow getting up here. Too slow. What are the... What is the other gem? Oh, I know what the other gem is used for. I know. Pretty sweet gems. We should go and uh, use one of these now. I also don't know how far in this video is because uh, in typical moly Saturday luck. Hello, Hunter. Oh, Jesus Christ. Well, that hurt. Jesus. That was not cool. This guy's just reamed me. I did earlier today think about uh, hooking my Xbox One up and trying Black Ops 2 out, but I think I would be so bad at that game at this point. And I don't even know if anyone still plays it, to be honest with you. Jesus. Oh yeah, I got hit twice, that's right. Oh, I put the wrong gem in. Idiot. Now we're gonna go back in. If I'm poisoned, I'm gonna kill someone. This has not been a great day of gaming for me, if I'm being honest with you. Even as I put it in, I read that it says tiger with yellow and blue eyes. That just still put the red one in. I don't know why. I'll take the MO disc. I think this is the room that original in the original one has the magnum in it. How are those snakes alive up there? Who's feeding them? Okay, so we've got that, that, I feel I should probably go back and put this MO disc in the, uh, in the chest. Yeah, 
I'm going to blame my brain not working on uh, the Elevate app. I don't know if I've talked about this, but I have started using Elevate, which I believe is a Google app. Uh, and it's like a little brain quiz thing each day. And I find it really helps. I just haven't done it for a week and a half. So my brain feels a little mushy today. And I was genuinely very excited to, to make these videos, to make the Resident Evil 2 video, which has since uh, depressed me into playing this one. Resident Evil uh, Remake is, well, I was going to say it's like it's uh, a comfort blanket, but <laughs> Resident Evil 2 would have been my comfort blanket, the original. I just, I just know that I owe you some videos. I don't want you thinking that I've given up already. Which was my main concern when my power was on. <laughs> I expected to open it and see, uh, open my comments and see, well, guess fix done with the games again. Which I would normally, uh... I would normally say is a, fa a fair bit. Uh, that's a weird little clue, because as far as I know, in the art room, uh, maybe that was his zombie then. The art room is that... Uh, one of the first rooms you go in. It's the one that in this series I believe I talked about how um Did I just drop out of him? No. Uh how the zombie walks in and he's really huge compared to Jill. Um so maybe he came out with the art piece. He's hiding back there, a little bastard. All right, let's see if we can get this this puzzle somewhat quickly. Probably not. Probably definitely not. I need this piece to move. Where does it move to though? Is it there? I think it's there. Uh... I promise you guys, I have played this game before. These, these pieces aren't in the right spots. There we go. Perfect. All right, there's the Spencer key. I also want to go up and get the uh, the uh, grenade launcher. I can't make I can't make it two games, two series for Resident Evil where I forget one of the best weapons in the game. Usually, I feel like I've got it before here, but I, I could be wrong. I know in the original, you can get it pretty quickly. 
armor. Did I not have the the armor key? Am I losing my mind? Is it in a it's probably in a box somewhere, isn't it? Okay. Let's go to the box and find out. It definitely is, now that I'm thinking about it. So I probably should have got this earlier. <sighs> I do like to think this is part of my charm, that uh, it's like watching someone who's never played a game before. I don't think I'm a terrible gamer, as much as I joke about it. Uh, I just do stupid things. Which I'm sure is what everyone does at home when they play games. It's usually because I panic at some point. Okay, we want that. And I think we want that. Let's see which keys these are. So I think they should both be used. Armor. And sword. Now, where is the sword one? That one was... On the third floor, I want to say. So. Let's go to the third floor. Actually, no, let's not. Let's go to the... First, and no, not the first, the the door in the hallway that I should have unlocked a long time ago, and then we'll go uh, to the third floor. One game I haven't played much is Fall Guys. I do mean to keep trying that. I've only played a couple times. I keep meaning to play it and get a win. I think I can get a win. I hope I can get a win. <laughs> I've, I've got pretty far in the two games I played. I think I got to like the third and the fourth. Uh, thing. It's forest. I assume that's how Americans pronounce it. I would say forest. But, uh, forest. They're just dead. Jill, you really couldn't lock on to the guy? He was right in front of you. There's probably some poor guy walking his dog in the park down there that's just got a fucking grenade round to his face. She's ruthless. And a bad shot. It's always the character. Much in the same way that in multiplayer when I die, it's not me, it's lag. It's all lag. I did play Apex Season 6 the other day. That was uh, an experience, I guess. What was the other door that needed the sword key? Uh, I'll watch this back and remember. I think it was. I think it's where I'm going. I just need to go and get some, some ammo. Because for some reason I've been using my shotgun as if it's my primary weapon, and it shouldn't be. At least yet. Usually when you get down to the labs, it should be. Can 
because that pestle ain't doing much damage on the old enemies. Okay, we're going to put pistol in there. I don't need the magnum for this. Sure fucking hope I don't. Acid shells are good with the hunters. I think. They're usually a one shot kill. And then the Magnum, I always save for the end. I do the same in the uh, original Resident Evil 2 with Leon. Even though it is really fun to one shot zombies' heads off from any distance. You know, maybe I will try Black Ops. What can go wrong, huh? Besides me being trash, or it's just no one playing. Oh, good. Oh yeah, the Magnum rounds. I assume that guy was gonna lunge forward, which is why I <laughs> uh, sent that second shot at him. Did I assume that this was... Is this not Yawn? Ah, oh, I thought it was Yawn. Now I have to remember where in the mansion I've got to go for that. I will run around until I find it. I will run around until I find it. I should probably look on the map. Very rarely use the map in this game. Which I guess is my fault. Oh, it's... Got it. Maybe? That fat guy could run. He was fast. Very fast. Oh, that's a lot of stuff I want to do tonight. I am one of those people that has so many games that I'll uh, just spend hours thinking what I'm going to play. Like right now, I've got Black Ops, I've got Warzone, I've got Apex. I've got... What else do I have? He just fucking... Or she. I believe that you is a she. Threw me right off that ladder. I also want to, I really want to get into No Man's Sky VR. But that is going to require some moving of things uh, in my in my basement. Got a lot of shit in my uh, little area that I set up for the VR. And I haven't completed Half-Life Alex, even though it is a uh, brilliant game. I really need to get on that. So many things to do, so little time. 
or if I just stop watching dumb YouTube videos, which is really what I do a lot of the time, then I could <laughs> play every game I wanted. Alright, let's go and save this. This has been a long episode, but as I haven't been around, I don't know if if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I want to get another uh, retro game up, but I'm not sure what. I'm thinking something from PlayStation. I'm thinking maybe something from... Maybe a soccer game. Think of FIFA 97 or 98, the one that has Song 2 by Blur. I think it's Road to the World Cup. Because I recently played that and I instantly felt like a 13 year old again. Just without the puberty and constant erections. The good old days. <laughs> uh, if you're 13, I'm sorry that you're having to deal with that. Just remember the tuck. I think every every young man knows the tuck in school. If, uh, if you sit next to a, a pretty lady and you find yourself awakening, awakening as it were, just... Tuck that bad boy up into your, your waistband and you're good. No one will ever know. I think people know. They have to. Do I end it on child directions? Uh, yeah, I think I should, shouldn't I? Let's save it. And then I'll be back. Uh, hopefully tomorrow. Hopefully tomorrow. I'll, I'll, I've got nothing going on. I'll get up. I'll make a video and and we'll, we'll continue the Moly channel uh, as if nothing ever happened. That I didn't take a two week break. Part of that was in force, so uh, I'm not going to apologize for that bit, although it sucks. Uh, anyway, I will see you soon. Hope you're all having a great weekend.